The breaking news, firefighters are working right now to put out a fire at what looks like a commercial building in Des Moines. This is live view of the smoke rising from 35th Street, very near Interstate 235. Now, smoke has been showing there right next to the freeway for about an hour now. Yeah, and our crew just arrived moments ago. KCCI's Marcus McIntosh is live at the scene. So, Marcus, what are you seeing? Stephen Stacy, as you just kind of alluded to right there, it this fire undoubtedly is having some issues or causing some issues on the morning on the afternoon commute or evening commute rather on I-235 because it looks like the smoke was billowing right over 235 here. So there's a lot of smoke. There are a lot of people looking to see what's going on. Now here is what we know. Now according to the Des Moines Fire, Par fire Department, the first call came in about 446. They were on scene about 450. Now we spoke with an owner of one of the businesses. He tells us the business or the buildings rather house two businesses a cabinet shop and his antique shop and an apartment or two. Now what he says is he was inside playing cards by himself when the fire broke out. He said he went outside, he could smell smoke in the building. He went outside and saw the flames and somebody else standing by called police. At this point there have been no injuries but there are quite a few firefighters on scene trying to put out the fire. The owner of the antique business tells us that he believes his business is a total loss. He believes the, the uh, cabinet shop is a total loss or the cabinet company is a total loss and basically anything in the building is a total loss at this point. That's the bad part. As I mentioned, the good part is no one was injured, no, no firefighter or no one who owns or lives in the building was injured either. So that is what's, what's good that can be taken from what happened here. Now we've talked to a number of people on scene who just say there was a lot of smoke. As you see, there's a lot of smoke. There were some flames in the building when we first got here, but at this point, firefighters are trying to knock down the flames. At about 4.50ish, 4, 5 o'clock, 5.10, something like that, the Des Moines firefighters tell us that they were pulled from the buildings in order to fight it defensively just because of all the smoke and the flames that were coming out of the building to make it safe for everyone. Plus, they backed people up about 25, 30 feet from where they were originally because they wanted people to be out of the smoke as well. We're going to have much more coming up a little bit later in the newscast. I'm Marcus McIntosh live in Des Moines, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader. Thank you, Marcus. If you know that area at all, it's that funky little building that sits right there on 35th west side of the street, right before 35th goes underneath I-235. And as you can see, it's right next to the freeway. Smoke pouring onto the freeway during the evening commute. This is a live look from the traffic camera at I-235 and 28th Street. Looking back to the west, the fire just seven blocks away. We'll have much more live coverage from Marcus McIntosh coming up later in this newscast. Big fire.